We made our deck too good that we couldn't draw two pairs anymore. We had too many jacks. Okay, I fucking hate this deck, man. I'm so happy we made some progress. How about plus two hand size, minus one joker slot? Yeah, yeah, the hearts, hearts are better than diamonds. It's so hard to go like out of your endless mindset and then go back into this like scarcity mindset, bro. Like I'm, I'm really out here playing default flushes. I used to score 7 million points a hand. It's a sad story. That must have been what it was like in the fucking dark ages, man. They were like 300 years ago, our ancestors built like aqueducts and shit. I asked my grandfather, hey, why don't we just build more aqueducts? He said, we can't, we don't know how. 97 year old town magistrate still builds irrigation solutions the old fashioned way. Open up the casino. Um, you, uh, you won't see heaven, just so you know. 10, 10 molt that could become anything. Holy. Very interesting. <laughs> yeah, wait, when I sell it, it's, we're going to lose 10 mold off of it. I don't know what to do with it, man. Pure ass. Pure ass. Hmm. Delectable. Hello, Quinn, by the way. How's Dota? Is there like a, a Dota... Like, this is the off-season, right? When do they come out with the compendium? I imagine that's when, when stuff really starts kicking off. Ramen. Don't mind if I do. We're Dota fans. Of course we won't see heaven. Did you see the post that was like, this is actually the best way to get to challenger level in League of Legends? And it was like a, a online gaming dark pattern exploitation post that was like, if you want to climb in rank, what you should do is just antagonize somebody on the enemy team, gank them and only them, and then type like concern troll in all chat and be like, hey guys, uh, is your like, Heimeldinger okay? Is he inting? And then like uh, slowly you will turn their team against them and like someone's mental will collapse and they'll just start intentionally dying. That's crazy, man. <laughs> I used to do that unironically. That's fucking sick work, man. That's disgusting. You're actually like ruining people's lives out here. <laughs> Legit strat. <laughs> That's fucking gross, dude. Are we really going? I guess we're going full flush Andy here. Mental warfare dipped in Mama Liz is so true, oil. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's a skip. This is a play, though. Hmm. And we, we gotta keep ramen juiced, brother. We gotta keep it juiced, even if it means sack towning a hand from time to time. I just type question marks whenever someone does anything in Overwatch and it does the same thing. I hear you, because as a streamer, nothing is like more annoying than saying something and just getting hit with like a wall of question marks. Even if you know that you didn't like do shit, you're like, holy fuck, am I cooked? See, even now, even now that I knew what was going to happen, it still messes with your head, man. Jupiter me. Joker's pure ass oil. This is a flush though. 
You cooked yourself the old-fashioned way. Um, you could be a diamond flush. I'm willing to take a chance on that. Did you change the lighting in your room? It looks weird. All right, everybody call off the dogs. I'm your friend. <laughs> Just chill out with the, with the gaslighting shit and the gang stalking and stuff like that. Just relax, okay? How about Mama Liz's extra Joker space oil? Hmm, okay. In a way, this, like, invisible Joker, it's a damn curse, man. It's a manacle. Because I can't get rid of it. It's my best Joker. Oh, fuck you, dude. Okay, fine, I'll discard. I'll discard it. I'll ruin ramen forever. I'll do it again. See if I care. Thanks for nothing. It gives more molt than your default Joker. I know, that's why I can't sell it, man. It keeps telling me active, active, active. No shot. Just get rid of it? No, because it's going to be worse. That's like how you lose. Give me that Jumbo Arcana pack, man. Give me the Jumbo Arcana pack. I did have some ramen this weekend. I don't want to get into the Vancouver ramen wars. It's a, it's a topic of uh, serious... People get their feelings hurt, you know? But I am... I've, I've eaten them all, more or less. And I got to tell you that after eating them all, I am still a ramen donbo head. It's just my... I'm not saying it's the best. I'm saying it's my favorite. Hate to do it. But I also want to live. They just opened one in Carysdale. Oh, I'm aware. Because <laughs> I, I love going to Dombo, but I hate waiting in line. So I say, you know what? If we're going to go to Dombo this weekend, why don't we go to the new one in Carysdale? Because no one lives there anyway. And wouldn't you know it, Wall Street in at 6 p.m.? No lineup. <laughs> try that shit on Robson Street, bro. Best of luck. You try that shit at West 4th at Kitsilano on a Saturday. I wish you the best. Okay, here's what you do. Sell me. Sell me. Sell me. I mean, this is a crazy play. Buy me. Sell me. Now we immediately need to get some flat molts. There is no joker here. This would go crazy. Oh, we're so fucking due though. Keep cutting diamonds. Good joker, please, please. Plus one hand size. Hiker, I, I have to take hiker. I can't take plus one hand size. Okay, we might be dead, but we're gonna try, okay? At least we can actually fucking discard some shit now. Hold, hold, hold. That's ass. This this is the key. The molt card, the double molt card is the key. Are you fucking kidding me, man? Give me a heart. It's so, it's never been so back. It's never been so over. We're cooked. <sighs> that one's tough. We, we, were, we were close to popping off. We just got a, a, a strange confluence of elements there. Invis hollow invisible joker that was unsellable yet unkeepable and then no flat malts joker if we get a flat malt joker that one's going to the fucking moon bro
Are we trying the new Slice and Dice update? Slice and Dice? I didn't even realize Slice and Dice got shooters, bro. Don't forget, you're here forever. It's me. It's a good game. I just... I, it's... Uh, I, I've, I've had my time with it. Campfire is insane. The thing is, we just have to live long enough to actually get it to pop. Which is scary. <laughs> we should be able to live through this hand. And we got three tens, two eights. I'm flush posting, I don't care. Hundred points. Okay, the bad thing is we're gonna have zero dollars after this now that I think about it. <laughs> now we gotta skip the one dollar decreased level of played poker hand. <sighs> okay, I think that we have to play bigger hands. Even a full house, I mean, I think we, if I'm being honest with you, I should build a moment and try to make it seem like there's a chance. But I think we're probably cooked any way you slice it here. We have a very powerful joker, but we don't have the econ to get this run off the ground. Yeah, I think it's a hold our situation, unfortunately. We need, we need a, a mult joker early on. That's how she goes sometimes. Discard. I mean, we, we our hand size is out of control. You gotta have a, a full house or something for us, right? No, no full house. Like, am I losing my mind? There's the full house. We also have seven, eight, nine, ten, Jack. Full house is better though. Seven, eight, nine, ten, Jack. <clears throat> have you unlocked Plasma Deck? I have. I have unlocked Plasma Deck. I have indeed. I like Empress. Early Empress is actually like better than a Joker. I know it's a controversial statement, don't get me wrong. Let's go, uh, let's start clubs posting. I don't know if we're going four flushes, but it, it's it's just what presented itself. Hmm, a death card. I guess we've we got some aces chilling in this deck. You could do worse than getting more aces. And then the worst swashbuckler of all time. Okay, it's not a great situation to be in to have no jokers, but it's it's where we're at. <laughs> Aces. We'd love, to, we'd love to draw one more king, please. Not disappointed in this so far, don't get me wrong, but I'd love to draw one more. No more kings. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. Get strength on. And then you guys get boosted. And look at this. Four of a kind on the, on the second ante. Like, that's pretty good. <clears throat> the back of this deck looks like... A Baskin Robbins after a fire. Okay, I expected that uh, what you said would make no sense, but you're absolutely right. I can see that. I, has anyone here ever uh, worked at a Baskin Robbins? What is it? What's the number? 57 flavors, or am I thinking of Heinz? 62 flavors? How many flavors do they have at Baskin Robbins? It's a famous number. 37, 37. If anyone here has ever worked at a Baskin Robbins, tell me something, okay? Some of those quirky flavors, like your the, the bubblegum birthday cake ice cream, you've been running that same tub since like 2021, right? I know vanilla, chocolate, strawberry, 
cookie dough like that shit you're you're going through like a tub every two days or something like that but <laughs> goldenrod espresso i know you're still rocking 2021 vintage mm, ice cream so old <laughs> i haven't been to a baskin robbins in a long time i am uh, i would say i'm dairy queen pilled right now I guess you keep the keep the queens. We know we're drawing aces though. Menchie's is good. I feel like Menchie's uh, it's a frozen yogurt spot. They kind of, uh, they popped off for a while and then they all disappeared. It was like in 2010 when like cupcakes started popping off everywhere. Like every mall ha had eight cupcake stores. And then like three years later, there were no cupcake stores left in existence. By the way, if anyone here is a restaurateur, I have a great business idea for you. I think, and everyone's gonna say no, that's how you know it's a good idea. <clears throat> the world is ready for a 2010 restaurant. A restaurant that mines 2010 nostalgia. I want a bottle of sriracha on every single table. I want posters in the restaurant that say keep calm and bacon on. We are so ready for a 2010 restaurant to come back. It's too soon. It's been 14 years, bro. He's cooking. <laughs> Finger mustache is so true. Plus two bit, minus two idea. You wouldn't catch me eating there, that's for sure. But everything's maple bacon. Every burger has a like runny egg on top of it and an onion ring. The burgers are all 32 feet tall. We're so ready. What am I doing? What is this run? This run is full houses and four of a kinds. It's anti two, don't cry. We're still just getting started. You're giving me 10 molt for free, which is freaking swag. I'm very appreciative of this fact. We're trying to draw our good aces. Yes, we are people. Yes, we are. Well, you are either a king or an ace. I'm gonna bet on you being an ace. In which case, we just play this. What do you have? Six of diamonds? What, do, what is it you do, the idol? I don't know. <laughs> I gotta think about it. It being eternal sucks. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't fucking know. I'm going in. Why haven't malls all died out yet? Uh, I, well, they're not busy. I'll definitely tell you that. But I think I'm part of like the last mall generation. I like the mall, man. Or at least I don't, I don't have the same kind of like negativity associated with the mall that like people 10 years younger than myself seem to have. Everything, the mall, here's, and I can already tell, people are gonna say NL's the modern Socrates. It's crazy to me that people out there like buffets but don't like malls. Because a mall is basically just a buffet of stores. As a result of having access to all this convenience and variety, yes, of course, every store is mid. The same way when you go to a buffet, like the butter chicken isn't as good as the butter chicken would be at an Indian restaurant. The orange chicken isn't as good as it would be at a Chinese restaurant. The chicken tenders aren't as good as they would be at a chicken tenders restaurant. But you embrace mid in exchange for the convenience of having access to a variety. It's the same thing with the mall. Yeah, when you go to the mall, you're not gonna be like, oh, check out this amazing one-of-a-kind thing I got at the mall. But you're gonna be like, check it out, bitch. I got chicken teriyaki, gym shorts, and my prescription filled, like all in the same day. Plus you get to walk around with the little orange Julius. It's just, you know, it's, it's a nice way to spend a, a couple hours sometimes. I'm not like 
you know, it's not my idea of a good time to go to the mall, like on vacation or something like that. But, you know, if you got nothing else to do, you can, you can kill 90 minutes in a mall. Easy mode. I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but... Remember, recall, you are playing four of a kind. Four of a kind. This is the way. We do not have four of a kind. So, I am going to play Dookie Butter. Wait, are you at six of... Uh, ten of clubs? We don't have it, okay. Ten of clubs. I hate you. Go ahead. That's four of a kind. This should be enough. And if it's not, we just hold R. It's that simple. Canadian malls aren't the same as American malls. Yeah, they're worse. You got us beat in a lot of domains, and that's that's certainly one of them. I could spend those 90 minutes grinding the Fortnite Battle Pass. You, uh, you will not see heaven. I know we're, we're going back to the well with these bits, but it's a certainty. It's a certainty that you will not see heaven. I don't want any of this shit. I want... I don't want any of this shit. Lego my ego. and send me. Negative Joker, it's just science, you have to do it. Uh, and then do this, okay. This this run has a chance, it's a slow burner. The same, your daddy's mama Liz's chili oil. Where's my ace, bro? You excited for Stranger Things Season 5? Yep. I'm over the moon. I can't wait to see what that nutty Demogorgon gets up to this time. Oh, come on with this. <laughs> we boycott? I mean, I've been boycotting it in a way for like, uh, probably like five years now. I just kind of, I guess I just kind of got sick of it at some point. Oh, my... I do have lots of, <coughs> pardon me, lots of aces of clubs. Negative eternal joker is not that big of a deal, but I'm not playing too many flushes. I just got to be honest with you, brother. I think that, like, I think we're in a, a, a tight spot. The joker I just sold, you wanted me to get it back? It would be wise to play even, like, club flushes with our cool aces might be the way. Like, you got a cool ace? It's a flush. It's a level one flush, but we're getting eight molt off of every single one. Ah, it fucking sucks, bro! <laughs> How about five of a kind? Okay, it turns out five of a kind, still pretty good. Club, club. I'm not feeling good about this one. It's ass. <laughs> I do feel like we're kind of just riding this one out until we die. Another negative joker, okay. Hanging by a thread. I'm actually um, holding on to, what is that? Wait, how, how does that Lifehouse song go? I'm hanging by a moment here with you. That's all it is. Aren't we all? It's damn true. It's damn true, brother. We have two clubs. Come on. We're so back. No salutes, please. The guitarist from Lifehouse tried to uh, my girlfriend in Las Vegas. Have you ever considered that he may have some sort of 
condition that means that he has to try to mm, your girlfriend in Las Vegas. Like, I would expect you to be like a little bit more compassionate. <clears throat> Every played card count in, counts in scoring. Bro's using the DoorDash rhetoric. I'm just saying, man. Hey, more aces, more aces. You didn't destroy an ace. I appreciate that. <laughs> it's so fucked up, man. You don't fucking do anything, bro. You don't fucking do anything. Four of diamonds? What am I gonna do with that shit? All diamonds are debuffed. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> Just what I needed. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. You guys want some cookies? I mean, we need five of a kind aces, I think. We got it. Two of our aces are debuffed. That's not great. Any chance you're, you're asking for a four of diamonds? That's right. I, uh, I think we're cooked, lads. I think we're cooked on this one. Stop tossing clubs, you melt. It's uh, no disrespect to you. I looked at my analytics yesterday for tax purposes. 5.2% of my Twitch audience is British. But it's actually so funny when a British person insults you. They start pulling out the fucking Jeffrey Chaucer shit. Shit you haven't heard since Beowulf and Grendel were beefing. You melt. <laughs> Bro's referencing the fucking Canterbury Tales and shit. He's saying shit like, get thee to a nunnery. I'm like, okay, Shakespeare, whatever. I bite my thumb at thee. Well, I bite my thumb at thou. This gets us there, no doubt. All right, we go again. I'm a double skipper. Never half step, because I'm not a half stepper. Drink a lot of soda, so they call me Mr. Soda. Dr. Pepper? No, I think we're good. You should, you should listen to the song again. Okay, abstract joker. Absolutely takeable. Absolutely takeable. Will lead us to kings. Can't take you, though. And you are generating three molt, which fucking sucks. But a reroll should give us another joker. Okay. Hand size plus some chips plus some fucking... It's cumulative. There's something to there's something to this one. Four, five, six, seven. Dump them. Don't dump them. Four, five, six, seven, nine. How about king, king, nine, nine? No, no, no. We really need to play a straight because it increments this fucking bad boy forever. Four, five, six, seven. Like you're you're joking me, right? You're joking me. Three, four, five, six, seven. Thank you. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Start there. And then we're straight chilling. Listen, I'll be honest, it's kind of dookie, but it does make abstract Joker better. I think we actually have a, a good thing going. We just need to play straights. Two, three, four, five, seven. Fucking, what the hell are you talking about? Give me some, sh give me, give me a straight, bro. Give me a. How can you not give me a straight off of this shit? I'll play king, king. Two, three, five. I guess I'll play king, king, jack, ten. That was a big hand. Okay, it turns out that was a good hand. How's your bracket looking? I'm trying to keep the heat off me, but I'm one of the 0.7% uh, of people on Earth right now that uh, still has a perfect bracket. I've gotten everything right so far. And the thing is, I um, 
Hang on, 10 jack, queen, king. Now we're, now we're cooking with gas. A lot of people, they'll, they'll ask me questions. They'll say like, how did you get a perfect bracket? And like, I, I don't know how to answer the question without it being insulting. I just picked like almost entirely the favorites, but then in situations where I knew that an underdog was gonna win, I went with the underdog instead. Like it was basically like a risk-free investment. So I'm, I guess I, I just consider myself lucky that like nobody's been able to replicate that strategy because that'll be, obviously it won't be as good for me if everybody's out there cooking up the same sort of perfection, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Maybe it's because I've been subsisting on NL chip VODs while I get through RSV, but is it just me or does NL look way younger today? Darker beard, ultra smooth skin, way more color in the face. Yeah, I had my ad ad adrenochrome dose uh, yesterday. It, it had been kind of like shut down for a while. But they got it. They hooked it up again. I've been getting blood transfusions from my daughter. No, actually, it's just that, first off, I appreciate it. But secondly, it was like I, I was sick last week. I was in a, I was in a bad spot. I was getting very pale. My mitochondria were, were being hijacked by influenza type A. And now, I mean, now we're straight chilling again. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You had that gray dickhead? That's true. That is true. I did. <laughs> The head of my penis did turn gray, which is not a good sign. But now we're chilling. I hate it when that happens. Girls just don't understand, man. When you and the lads get together and start talking about when the head of your penis changes color, <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. I'll delete it. Um, give me this. Okay, we just keep playing straights. We're we're doing every encounter because we wish to increment a runner. I mean, people will tell you you shouldn't base your entire run around the first Joker that you get, but what if that first Joker is fucking runner, negative runner, bro? You got to give him a chance. <clears throat> it's fun. I'll take us to fucking Saturn any day of the week, bro. It's probably the best planet. You ever think that Uranus gets sort of like pissed off? Because Saturn gets all the credit for having rings, but Uranus also has rings. Then people are like, yeah, but the rings are like vertical instead of horizontal. Then man, fuck you. a straight right there. Uranus flexes. It's an ice giant. It's fucking like negative, negative 254 degrees Celsius on that bitch or something. Twitch shatters from Norway have been real quiet ever since the Uranus weather forecast dropped. You thought you had it bad in Svalbard? It's fucking three degrees Celsius in July. Well, why don't you go to Uranus, motherfucker? It's almost absolute zero in this bitch. Shut up. <laughs> I guess is what I'm trying to say at the end of the day. I'm trying to say shut up. Ace, two, three, four, five. That's a freaking straight right there. It is a Stephen A. Smith type bit. Saturn, I get it. Saturn's got rings, but you, you, you gotta consider the longevity of Uranus. You gotta consider the blueness of Uranus. Hang on, ace, two, five, six, seven, so we can get that bonus Andy, that doesn't work. Ace, three, five, six, seven, now we're talking. Stephen A. Smith is a William Herschel stan. I've never been like more thankful to not know what the fuck that means. I don't know what that means. It's not as limited as a as a Mercury. So true. But actually, okay, listen. 
Listen, listen. I think we gotta dump Smiley here and try for something a little crazier. We got we gotta take a swing. Uh, I regret it. I do. He's the guy who found Uranus. Oh, well, he's taking credit for Uranus. Uranus obviously existed before he found it. No disrespect or whatever. Why did I keep seven sevens? It doesn't make any sense. You gotta keep one seven, bro. Seven, eight, nine, ten, queen. Why are you saying Uranus like that? That's how I say it. Uranus. Buffoon me. You know what? We could at least talk about even Steven here. Upgrade straight by three levels. Don't mind if I do. Four, five, six, eight, nine. That's a straight in this household. And dude, I'm just realizing how many... I could do some cookery. Nine, jack, king, <laughs> queen, king, ace. Because we with the gaps, we could do like just even cards in some circumstances. But ideally, I'd love to get rid of this joker and get a better one at some point. Oh, anti <laughs> oh, that's good stuff, man. That is good stuff right there. Come on. Me thinks the game doth protest too much. I mean, we got we got to dump our our face cards, bro, because we got five, six, seven, eight. Those are even Andes. So you play five, six, eight, ten, and maybe throw a little seven in there just to enable it. It's not as limited as a flush. And then you play a flush with two evens. That's still pretty good, honestly. What are we at here? 180 chips out of runner. Nothing wrong with that. Negative mail-in rebate. I'm sorry, we have to purchase antimatter instead. Base chips and molt are halved. Not ideal, but ace, two, four, six, seven. Oh, but imagine, we should throw the five in if we're gonna do that, but imagine if it was fucking two, four, six, eight, ten. Oh, baby, oh. <laughs> this actually looks kinda tough. Don't do me like that, man. Ace, two, three, four, seven. I think we need to buy a joker in our next shop, but I don't know what we're gonna replace. Oh, we have antimatter. We don't need to replace shit, bro. We don't need to replace shit. <sighs> Come on. Come on. Now it's, you're just getting a little goofy-footed with it now. Okay, you're being, a, you're being a real piece of work. How about King King 7-7? Seven, seven? We keep an 8. Six, eight, nine, ten, with a little 4 kicker. I'm still alive. Uranus has numerous climate phenomena that science can't understand. Um, you sure? You talking about the hexagonal demon cloud? By the way, I cannot afford a joker. So I don't know what you want me to do. I mean, I can afford this joker, but he's not gonna give me 50 chips. So what's the point? So what, what would you do? I guess you could, but you'd roll and then you'd have to sell to get a joker. So I don't know, I, I guess you just gotta fucking... Oh, you're, you know what, you're right. It is three molt at the end of the day because of abstract joker. It's probably about as good as we can get. Two, three, four, five, seven. Not the best straight you're ever gonna see, but it's... It's something, okay? It's like exactly good enough. I would love to create more evens given the opportunity, please. Two, three, five, that's not even close. You can dump it, dump it, dump it, and dump it. I think we're fucked, guys. I think we're fucked. 
going to dump a 9 and a 10, and a 5 and a 3 and a 2. Then you can play 9, 10, Jack, King, Ace. At least there's a bonus card and an even. And then you got 2, 4, 6... You got 2, 3, 4, 6, 7 with some bonuses attached. And then you got 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. We make it! We make these. Thank you to Runner for holding us in the game. We have $9. Brother, can I get a Joker that isn't fucking detritus, please? Thank you. Um, how many straights have we played? 22 of them! <laughs> oh! Okay. Two, five. Mm, I can, I see a problem with this. Five, six, seven, eight, ten. I see a solution. Plus 32 molten increasing. So yeah, I'm saying we're back. Two, three, four, five, seven. We really, it would be nice to be able to sell even Steven and then just get one multi multiplier. And then I think we at least win anti eight. Although we're probably cooked after that. Come on, get, get my econ going. I know we're down to zero dollars, but like, what am I gonna do with this shit, bro? Let's just be realistic. Like, what, what do you want me to do here? <laughs> Remove some face cards from my deck. And fucking, I don't know, wild up a five. Antediluvian machines. Me when I use a screw. I hear that. Three, four, six, seven, eight. I mean, we have four, six, eight. We have four, six, eight, nine, Jack. That's a straight. Antediluvian's kind of a banger word. It's a big one, it's, a, it's an important word. Perfectly cromulent word. I cannot afford We Joker, unfortunately. I would love to, but it's a little late to start building it. Hand size is good too, but I think we're I think we're we're chilling. First hand is drawn face down. Ace two four six eight. Oh, ho, ho, baby! Fifty four thousand points. Ace two. Three, four, six. Six, seven, nine, ten, queen. We're actually so back. I think we're so lucky that we had we got this runner early. But this is usually by anti eight, you're like, my ass is dead or my ass is easily winning. We're like right on the fucking borderline right now. How about a jumbo spectral pack? Well, well, um, we will deja vu on an even card. <laughs> it's getting a little tight. How about a Saturn? No Saturn. Okay, how about an Earth then? What do you want from me? Flips and shuffles all jokers. Actually, doesn't matter as long as we make sure swashbucklers on the right. But it's going to be close, guys. It's going to be close. 810 Jack, Queen, King. Where's Mars on your solar system tier list? It's pretty high up. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie to you. I mean, what are the worst planets in the solar system? Ever since they yeeted Pluto, like we're kind of chilling. Like most of the planets are pretty good. Mercury is probably the worst. I just don't see the point. Um, and then like Uranus and Neptune, I just think that they have a PR problem. 
because it's like after Saturn, it's like they got Uranus, they got Neptune. Which one's the big blue one? Which one's got the rings? Like they just they 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 kind of get lost in the in the shuffle together. They're like twin planets. There's no doubt Earth is up there. Venus, I feel like Venus kind of sucks ass too. Like I'm it's not going to hold it against it, but like a planet that's filled with like choking sulfuric acid clouds, like that sounds not nice for sure. So I gotta say, like, Earth is up there, Saturn is up there. Saturn's just the coolest planet, I resisted it for a long time, but it's true. And then I think number three, you gotta say it's either Jupiter, because it's big as fuck, or you gotta say Mars, because it's so close, and yet it's so far away that it captures the human imagination. That's my, that's my top three planets. Four, five, seven, eight, Jack, that does not get you there. Four, five, seven, eight, ten gets you there. Sorry, it's just not in the cards, brother. Ace, two, three, five, six is in the cards, though. You're telling me it's not Planet X, which we're doomed to collide with like every other year? Is that true? Is that one of those things where like it, uh, we pass like, they're like, this is the closest this planet has ever been to Earth. And then when you actually look at the real news story, it's like 100 trillion miles away. Hey, times three molts, if your hand contains a straight and it's polychrome, they basically said you win. I appreciate that. <laughs> they they said you fought your fucking ass off to get to this point. Enjoy this. Dead ass. This is swashbuckler. I saw it. I saw it. Ace two four five seven. Endless me. Okay, we were off by one, but whatever. I don't think we have much of a future, to be honest, but the fact that we made it through that run was kind of sick. So then, it's just, it's really hard to scale a, a straight build. Because you can't just duplicate like the same cards over and over again. You should dump your three and a six and a queen or an ace. Two, four, six, eight, ten. I guess what, what do we care about evens anymore? We should try to keep cards together. Like two, three, four, six, seven at least gives us a high straight potential at the end. I'm proud of us though. Anytime you win with a straight build, I'm feeling pretty good about it. Any words of wisdom for those of us experiencing sunnis, sudden penis explosion syndrome? Um... I think I gotta look up the the symptoms of this sudden penis explosion syndrome. Six, I want six, seven, eight, nine, ten. First, we're gonna do that. Is this is a real thing. I'm alt tabbing. Sudden penis explosion syndrome. Google did not autocomplete. <clears throat> Coro. Koro is a culture-bound delusional disorder in which individuals have an overpowering belief that their sex organs are retracting and will disappear. It's also known as shrinking penis. <laughs> the syndrome occurs worldwide and mass hysteria of genital shrinkage and anxiety has a history in Africa, Asia, and Europe. Sorry, in North America we're just built different. The word was borrowed from Malay and means head of a turtle. Referring to how it looks when they retract their heads into their shells. Human brain is crazy, man. Can you imagine going to the doctor and you're like, my penis is going to shrink and fall off? No wonder my ass can't get an appointment. I don't want any of this shit. What am I, what am I doing? Three, four, six, seven, eight. That's a straight. <clears throat> dunk, 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 dunk. Nine, 
Captain Jack Queen King. Were you in the pool? That's the first question the doctor has to ask. You've astutely noticed that for sure. Because if you were in the pool, like all bets are off. It works. We're shrinking dick, yo guys. <laughs> Five guys are shrinking dick in Munchen. Plus one hand size. Spectral pack. Hmm. Cryptid. Grim. Familiar. All of these are ass. I don't want any of this sh I guess I'm gonna cryptid this because it's got something going on, but then like, I'm skipping the rest, man. Cause like, I think we're just, I, I'm just leveling with you. I think we're, we're cooked. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't think we have a way to scale this run. It's fine. I, I, I'm happy to have just made it as far as we did. Three, four, six, seven, nine. Dipped in Mama Liz's shortcut oil. Two, four, six, seven, eight. Did you see the tweets about r slash adultery? And the dude who got upset his wife lied about knowing he was cheating? Yes, I did. I did see the, the posts about the guy who was cheating on his wife. And then he felt betrayed that she had apparently discovered that he was cheating several months ago, but kept it a secret from him so that he got blindsided when she left him. And everybody in the comments, I mean, this is r slash adultery, but everybody in the comments is like, bro, you cheated on her. And he's like, I know, but I just didn't think that she had this in her. And I was, you're like, what are you talking about, man? <laughs> Like, nobody was giving him any sympathy at all. Which is fair. It was a great, a great post. Three, four, five, six, seven. Egg is rocking the stubble. I think um, I have accepted I am going to grow a beard. For a bit at least. Not for a bit, like not for comedic purposes, but for for a, a period of time. This is it, my friends. This is the end. And the horseshoe. I haven't decided what length to keep the horseshoe at, um, but I do like having a little horseshoe, honestly. This might even be a little too much. Like maybe we got to trim this down a little bit. But definitely the beard's got a way to go. Okay, slash marker me. We'll call that Balatro 2. 